Your detention will be served every day after classes for one week. What? <laughs> Don't be droll. I sincerely doubt you're hard of hearing. And speaking of hearing, listen up. You are here because our new king thought he would be magnanimous and allow the likes of you to attend our university. Some of us are wise enough to know that a BK can only ever become a villain. Now get out of my classroom. One more time, why are we in the library? It's closed. Because we need something more than just how to enchant a pumpkin to frighten the VKs. We're not kids anymore. Besides, all the sinister enchantment books are locked up in a special section. So how will we know what we're looking for? Uh, just come on. The arcane section. I don't like this. You're not supposed to. Now follow me. Audrey, this place is creepy. And this is wrong. Let's leave. Stop it. We didn't come this far to leave now. Besides, it wasn't easy sneaking in here. I don't care. It's just too weird. Let's go. <laughs> Keep whining and the night guard will toss us out. Now sheshies. Chad is quite a guy. We owe him for the snipe hunt. Any ideas? Well, we could always do what we did on the aisle. Right. And be sent home immediately. All right. So we'll give it an Oridon University flair. You know, Audrey really had a big reaction to her picture on the front page. Why not share the spotlight with Chad? What a refreshing idea. What's his problem anyway? Whoa, I don't remember leaving the room like this. Do you? No. Someone definitely broke in here. Oh no. My necklace is gone. My mom wanted me to wear it right away, but I forgot because of that stupid dance. She is going to witch out on me. Why'd she want you to wear it anyway? She said it was so we could talk without being watched by the guard. What do we do now? Whoever took it won't know how it works, so we'll just get it back. What if your mom contacts the person who stole it? You'll have to tell her before she tries to use it. I guess I'll write her a letter and hope she gets the message. Oh, gee, we have a quiz tomorrow. A reading from Chaucer. One that abril with its shower so It sounds like a spell. Mm -hmm. The drop day of Mar- Expecting someone? No. Ben, what are you doing here? I know it's late, but I was hoping you would come take a walk with me. And um, what about curfew? Oh, I'm king, so I can overlook it this time. Hmm, aren't you doing something kind of bad? It sure is good to be king. Okay, just give me one minute. Sure. He wants to go for a walk. So go. After you make him wait, of course. Do you think he suspects? No, he has no reason to suspect anything. Mm, maybe, but I don't trust him. You don't have to. Right. How do I look? Perfect, as always. I don't like it. It's scary and dark and scary. Shut it. I'm trying to find something and then we can go, okay? Who's there? This place gives me the creeps. Probably the mice again. Okay, so that was close. Too close. Can we leave now? Uh, yes, you big baby, come down. So, you still haven't told me if you like it here. It's okay. Maybe a little too perky, but the food is way better. That's a start. Look, I know you're trying to be nice, but it's kind of hard to ignore that Oridon has had all this, and we've had the opposite. Fair enough. That is why. When I became king, I decided the VK had a right to all of this. You shouldn't suffer for what your parents had done. You really believe that? Yes. My mother saw more in my dad than just a beast. She gave him a second chance. And so, 
here we are. <laughs> oh. Yeah, here we are. Now that we are all assembled, I am summoning this council meeting with great alacrity to discuss the current situation with our children in Oridon. Grimhilda and I have been observing the girls through the crystal ball. Is everything going according to plan? I am very certain Jay is exceeding all expectations. He can face a myriad of difficulty and remain staid. Superiority runs in the family. The necklace cleared their security. Pitiful idiots. The initial attempt at the wand by Mal failed because the fairy godmother bibbity boo booed the effort. Now that we're all on the same scroll, for the interim, we've no choice but to wait. The fairy godmother has sent a notice that on family day we can conference with the children via the looking glass. How vulgar! The imbeciles should allow us to meet face to face. In due time, dear Cruella, meeting adjourned.